Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Bilal Abdul Karim for OGN. We are in the small township of Barisha. Now, this is the area where it's believed that the uh, U.S. forces killed ISIS uh, leader Abu Bakr Baghdadi uh, just uh, early in the wee hours of this morning. Now, according to local residents here, the uh, commandos were lowered into the area approximately 11.30 p.m. There was a firefight, and at the end of it, approximately 2.30 a.m., there was an airstrike which leveled a house just over this hill. Now, we don't have access to that house just yet, but we're going to try to see if we can get in there. The reports that we're getting so far are there are 12 dead. Now, the uh, U.S. coalition, or I should say the U.S. forces, uh, uh, took two bodies with them, and it appears that they are still digging other bodies out from underneath the rubble right now. Now, just behind me here, you have a vehicle which uh, local residents have been saying was actually trying to flee the area um, at the uh, at the point of the attack. And as you can see, it was hit and it was destroyed. On this side over here, there's another house that has um, th that apparently has got a lot of uh, uh, pock marks in it. Um, there was some shooting that was obviously taking place here. Now we're going to have to try to follow this thing up to figure out exactly what happened. Um, uh, was this Abu Bakr Baghdadi? Was it not? It is believed that it was. Um, local residents all say that um, the people there didn't mix with the other people all that much. They came and they went, but there wasn't a lot of mixture or talking with them. We'll follow it up. My name is Bilal Abdul Karim, OGN. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.